Good evening, everyone. I'm here with a late night broadcast. It's Jason, it's Mecha Taco, and we are on day something of Animal Crossing. So far, we've invited uh, Shep, we've invited Chester, and we've invited somebody else. Oh, Kabuki, of course. It's early, as you can see. Yay, Chester's here. Uh, the goal, in case you're watching this video instead of part one, is to restore my family's island back to its original glory. And in doing so, oh, in doing so, it gets something in my eye, evidently. To do so is what I meant to say. In order to do so, we need to invite all of our old favorites uh, and some of our not so old favorites uh as well as make them say rude things and just generally make the island you know better so uh without further ado let's get going oh i got mail oh sherry sent me something thanks sherry <laughs> That's Jude. All right. Oh, what did Sherry give me? Some pleather pants. <laughs> Thanks, Sherry. We're going to go clubbing later. All right, let's see. So it's not a, it's not a day in Animal Crossing without digging up some fossils. So I'm trying something new again, uh, as far as the recording of this video is concerned. Last broadcast, I had a catastrophic failure. Animal Crossing was fine. Animal Crossing went great, in fact. Um, that was weird. And then I played protect me night and it, it was it was great it, it was an awesome playthrough it was hard uh i i was got to one mission where i just kept dying and then i finally you know, triumphed over it and my computer informed me that i was out of hard drive space and it didn't save i did my best to recover it no, no dice. Uh, it was like an hour and 45 minutes worth of content down the tube. Not the YouTube. The toilet tube. How's that? <laughs> it sucked. It royally sucked. I was just distraught. Um, I, my problem, of course, is that I was recording raw. Uh, I wasn't doing any compression whatsoever. Uh, I was waiting to do compression, basically when I edit the video. Um, but not this time. So I changed. I changed some settings. I'm still recording at an extraordinarily high bit rate. But it should guarantee that I have some space. We'll see. All right, let's in, let's invite. Let's check here first. We'll take the servant card. Thank you very much. Who are we inviting today? I'll tell you who we're inviting today. Inviting my friend Mike's. It's been a long day. Good day. It's been. It has been a good day. It's just been. It's long. Yes, yes, yes. I would like to invite a camper. Who are we inviting? Well, we are inviting... Uh, let's see. That's Sterling. 
We're inviting Sterling, who happens to be on this Alita top figure. I realized. Well, I, you know, hold that, hold that thought. Let's let's see Sterling. I haven't seen Sterling in years. Man, why am I so bright? There he is. Look at that guy. <laughs> Sterling thinks he's a knight. I love him. So, oh, we gotta change. We have to change all of their catchphrases. I realize in tagging Alita. Well, uh, first thing, uh, I actually have several of these like Alita pop figures, all of which already have tags on them. There's like Anka, Lucky. Uh, I don't even remember half of them, but yeah, that was neat. Anyway, uh, it occurred to me that in the time that... Oh, dang it, Ors. Okay, I got my designs. In the time that I had stopped doing Mecha Taco, um, and then started it up again, you know, there's this kind of a five-year break because um, life <laughs> life gets in the way um, no not there you goofball that's not even the right one hang on I, let, me, let me fix this a little bit closer all right let's try this again I need a dirt path then I need that one. Oh my, oh, you're such an idiot. <laughs> there. Thank you. Now I'll erase that one, you goof. That, in that five year gap, the Battle Angel movie came out. The, the Battle Angel movie that was supposed to come out years ago. Um, you know, James Cam James James Cameron's you know pet project um, that was only produced by him because he was working on Avatar, which to this day I've never actually seen Avatar or its you know legendary sequel. Um, I don't really care. Uh, but Battle Angel. Uh, big fan of the manga, uh, and big fan of the anime, despite the fact that the author is not apparently not a fan of the anime. I saw the movie. It was it was released on Valentine's Day. Um, many seems like eons ago. It was probably a few years ago. And I just oh gosh. It, it was it was quite some time ago actually now that I think about it. Anyway, I loved it. Like it was everything fifteen year old me wanted in a Battle Angel movie. And I'm totally okay with that. Um, does it bother me that we won't probably won't ever get a sequel or anything? Yeah. Cause I liked it a lot. And it, it had a lot of promise. Um, I like the CG. Uh, Alita's model was awesome, I thought. Uh, and her character design was cool. You know, it was weird. But, you know, she's a cyborg. And I felt that she had just the right amount of Uncanny Valley to make her believable um, and different. But no, I thought it was just a fun action movie, and it, it was really cool. Um, so yeah, I, I dug it. I dug that one. As far as Hollywood adaptations of anime are concerned, yeah, that's, that's a pretty high bar uh, to attempt to surpass that I just don't see happening. And it, it does it does suck that it's not going to recover really. Um, 
And now we won't get another one. Um, but who knows? Maybe we'll get a TV series in this, you know, this day and age of turning movies into TV series. For better or worse. Ah, there it is. That's what I was looking for. Money. Ooh. Put away. My inventory is full. Alright, let's go. Let's go drop this. Let's go bury this. And then... Todd Sterling. If you haven't seen it for whatever reason, geez, just go. It's, let's go see it. I'm sure you're in I'm sure you're clever enough to, to find it online somewhere. You could do a lot worse. Let's not put anything away quite yet. Well, we'll put away the clothes and stuff that we don't actually need. There we go. Wait. Okay, I did. Just making sure. Alright, Sterling. Let's talk with you. He's got his little coffee. What up, Sterling? Man, I haven't seen you in years. An iron frame would look cool. Evidently, I know how to make one. So for the past week, I've been I've been remodeling um, the basement to turn it into Reese's room, and I today as of today it is ninety nine percent done, ninety eight percent done, ninety five. It's it's mostly done, okay, and it looks cool. It's 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 the type of bedroom that I would want. Um, man, I would have loved it as a as a kid. It's sharp. I, I'm really, really proud of it. Um, yeah, I'm not I'm not exactly a handyman per se, but I like to think that I managed to put together something pretty decent. I don't know what I, I don't know what an iron frame looks like. I'm just guessing. That's what you want? <laughs> Man, that would be sweet. Sure. Well, whatever. Sterling, whatever floats your boat, man. But. All done. The, the loft bed. I had ordered one off of Amazon. And, you know, it's it's a do-it-yourself jobby, uh, jorby. And Rachel and I put the bulk of it together. Um, I had put the top on backwards, so I had to take it off, switch it around. That was fun. Um, but, you know, it was, it was rickety. Uh... 
So yeah, I ended up, you know, bolting it to the wall, which I was going to do anyway. And yeah, it, that thing's not going anywhere. Just, it looks so cool. And it's cool. I like the loft. The loft bunk bed is really cool because it does have a nice desk underneath. Um, totally jealous because I would love to have that set up for streaming. Um, instead of this monstrosity that I have set up here, I, I wish you could see it to appreciate it. Um, it just looks like my computer barfed out it, its innards everywhere. and I've got random lights and cords and everything. It's fine. I'm not bitter. <laughs> That's right. I will ask you again. There we go. Day one. Sterling. We should ditch some of this stuff, is what we should do. Um. I should sell. I should sell one of this. Alright. Uh, am I missing anything? Do, did we... We got the money. We haven't seen Chester yet. I don't know what that was. Oh, Tiger Beetle. I don't know what... Where's Chester's home? <laughs> we have to change Kabuki's home. There's Dottie. Sherry. Rald is home. Should we visit Rald again? We'll visit Rald again. Just to look at Rald's home. I love Rald's home. Oh, he's getting ready for bed. Oh my gosh, look at this place. It's the Army Navy surplus store. He's watching his little idle videos. <laughs> it's yours. It is me. <laughs> oh, you're gonna have a workout, buddy. Got a jar of pee up there. <laughs> oh, it doesn't take much. All right. Do you want a coconut? Or do you want a peach? You get a peach. I just don't know what the hell it is. Hang on. Alright, that's what I'm wearing right now. So what is it? What's this? Oh. Oh. Dull. Alright, we're all in my underwear now. You know, we've been wearing kazuko for a while. We can do Shep. Yeah. That's my Shep look. Alright, cool. Alright, Rold. Rold? 
Oh, okay. I thought he had bugs, but it, I, I believe I did that. I put flies around his house. All right. What's next? We definitely have to be friendlier with our neighbors. Okay, Chester's out. Before we leave tonight, let's get rid of the fossils. That looks suspiciously like Shep's house. Oh, I was wrong. I was way wrong. Oh, man. I, I really think Deanna's gonna... She's gonna leave. I like her, but... Yeah. yeah. Do you want this? Rold gave it to me off his back. I actually like the outfit he had on, whatever that was. <laughs> We're just passing around Rold's tips. Sorry, Deanna, I'm not going to give you anything. Anybody else home? Chester, Sherry, Sherry, that's a great house. That's Raymond. That's Dottie. I need to look at my map. That's a tough one. So we can have there's one more villager that that we're missing. That's Marshall. Um, where are we to bring Marshall in? Dottie would probably be the one to go. I like Dottie because she looks like a Dragon Quest line. Yeah. I didn't think about that. That's hard. Oh, hey, Kabuki. It is me. Want to chat? Let's chat some more. I have not had a chance. I want you to have a coconut. A coconut? It smells darn good, too. Thanks, buddy. All right, moving on. Oh, Sherry, how you doing? Getting down? You're dressed like a brownie, but that's fine. Yeah, you know it. Sherry's great, even if she pees on her hands. All right. Man. 
Oh, there's Kuroki. Oh, he, he just waved. Let's go identify... Let's identify these fossils that I have on me now. Sell them. Save the game. And then... Protect me, Knight. I need to get through it. Because there's other stuff I want to play. And again, I'm enjoying the game. I really am. Nobody's watching. Which, again, is fine. Because I don't really care. But at the same time, I'm like, really, guys? People have no taste. Uh, assess fossils. The, the channel's stuck at, um, 1,900 subscribers right now. The vast majority of which are probably dead. Um, and came, you know, came along with, uh, the Berserk video. But I'm bound to determined to get it up to 2,000. It, it bounces between 1,900 and 1,890, uh, which is so weird. Oh, come on! I just need 10 more. Just I just I just want that that additional. I just want a, that nice even 2,000. I, I don't know. It doesn't matter. It's one of those things. So hey, if you subscribe, I will sign a magic card for you and send it your way, or I'll sign a poster of myself. <laughs> I don't get it. Why would you want? Yeah. I'd... Why would you want that? Hey, I have the prof I had the professor sign a magic card for me. The who? Yeah, exactly. No offense. No offense, Tolarian Community College. Um, I, I do appreciate um, the, the bulk of your content. They do a... There we go. They do a... Uh, a a segment called uh, Shuffle Up and Play, uh, which is in Seasons for whatever reason. Um, I should do Seasons. Seasons are very popular right now. Anyway, um, and it's just, it's just, uh, typically it's, um, you know, the channel's host and other magic related influencers. Um, play magic and honestly honestly for the most part it's very it's an interesting show it's it's kind of fun to watch um it really depends on who is on there because as you can imagine as influencers you have a whole table full of influencers trying to out influence one another it's the most obnoxious thing sometimes uh, but then you have guys who are there just to play I say guys, I, I mean that in a general term. There's men and women. Um, and, and undefined. Um, and yeah, it's just... Like I said, sometimes it's actually entertaining. Um, and other times it's like, oh my, just stop. <laughs> like, like a real life magic. It's worth checking out if if you're into magic. If you're not, uh, it's not gonna turn you on to magic. <laughs> In any case, folks, 
mission accomplished for tonight. I'm Jason. Thanks for joining us. And we will see you soon. I am ready to wrap things up. Everybody's leaving, so might as well. <laughs> Sorry, just sure sat underneath the tree. Good night, folks.